Hi, I'm Louise from Serum Tractors. Hi, I'm Helen from Serum Tractors. And today we're going to talk to you about one of the most common questions we get asked about PTO shafts. One of the common questions we get is which type of um, PTO shaft is required for each piece of equipment. So in this case, for this topper, it is a shear bolt PTO. Um, I've never changed a shear bolt PTO, so uh, this afternoon Louise is going to show me how to do it. <laughs> Great. So um, on a piece of equipment like a topper, we always supply a PTO shaft, a shear pin PTO shaft. The shear pin is the weak point so that when the topper is cutting your grass and it's got an awful lot of momentum, if it was to hit something like a rock, something really hard, which brought it to a sudden standstill, that momentum that's still left, if, the, if there wasn't a shear pin protection, that would damage potentially the gearbox on the topper and even worse, the gearbox on your tractor as that travels down the PTO shaft. Um, so what we'll show you is that the shear pin um, is missing because the, it's broken and been lost in the field. Um, so what we're going to do is take this guard off. Mm -hmm. Take the guard take off. The guard off. <laughs> so that shear pin really is like the weak point. So it's the point that breaks to protect the rest exactly. of the machine. Exactly. And the tractor. And the tractor. Now not all pieces of equipment require a shear pin. Um, for instance, flail mowers and finishing mowers because they have belts. And so that acts as their weak point. So the belt, oops, the belt will fail instead. instead. Yeah. So what you can see here is that the PTO shaft is going to keep turning. So the shear pin would have been through here. So this is the shear pin here. Um, and that will PTO shaft will turn, but obviously the gearbox isn't turning. So when this happens, you, you need to get the shear bolt out of here. Obviously, it's, it, it'll, have snapped, it'll have snapped. So you just need to remove it yeah. from there. Potentially, the whole lot will have come off. Okay. You know, and be, be lost in your field somewhere. But yet, you might have half of it still left in there. Sure. So it's just a case of lining the holes back up, getting the correct size um, shear bolt. We obviously supply these if, if required. I know some people like to keep them on the shelves just in case. So I'm gonna yeah, put that back in. Okay. Toppers, stone barriers, power harrows, anything that doesn't have, have its own belts is going to require some sort of protection on its PTO shaft. Excellent. So um, that's great. If you've got any ideas for any other videos you'd like to see from us, please comment below. <laughs> Make sure to hit that subscribe button and the thumbs up. Yes, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Any, can we start again? Yeah. Start again. <laughs> yeah, I did this exact same thing for this time. <laughs> 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 Cut!